The view from my living room window is compelling, although I can only see down a very minor, claustrophobic canal, towards a bridge over which very few people pass. The tall buildings that press hard up against the water on either side are, architecturally speaking, unremarkable, although there are some wonderfully ornate brick chimneys on the skyline. I regularly see a variety of small boats putter past with smoky outboard engines. There is rarely anything as grand or as romantic as a gondola. But because I live in Venice, the view is a miniature masterpiece. I was considering the rather science fiction notion of someone travelling perhaps in time but certainly moving between parallel dimensions and how their actions might have quite unexpected consequences. And I wanted to show this from a distance, um, someone at several removes from the chaos that's been created, to show how the changes might be fundamental but really quite small. And I chose Venice as the setting because it is a city that's in many ways unchanging and yet in a perpetual state of decay, very, very fragile but somehow resilient. Really not the sort of place where you want someone crashing between dimensions, albeit slightly off the page.